All right, boys, we are now entering the fort. Off. That's pretty cool. What are you boys doing? Yeah, you tell them. All right, just kidding. We're still in Ohio. Now we're in Indiana. What did you get? What did you get today? You Christmas collar showed up. Oh. Oh my goodness. Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the vlog. My name is Will. Lotus. Enzo. I know what we're going to do today. We're going to go to a brand new parky that we've never been. You've never been. I've never been. You guys have never been. I don't know what's going to happen. As you can see, we got quite the amp build up. Plus, there's going to be a special guest in the vlog. So definitely should be a good day. As you know, we didn't have any luck with the Christmas gifts yesterday, but I think we might have a little bit more luck today. And I have my wallet with me, so. All right, all right. We gotta go, we gotta go. First, oh my gosh. No, 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 I need to vacuum first. No, 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 I, I need to vacuum. No, Lotus, come on. Boys, I need to vacuum. You gotta get out. No, we're still gonna go somewhere, but I need to vacuum first. I gotta vacuum all the fur. Yes, we need to get it out. It's a mess, it's gonna be blowing around at me. Oh my gosh. Watch the paws. Watch the paws. I think we need the extra power mode. Eco, no, eco ain't gonna work. Uh oh, the battery died. Well, pop. Dang, that's never happened before. All right, uh, we'll have to make that work. Eco mode, eco mode, eco mode. All right, yesterday we got so busy we forgot to mail these cards, so I am sorry, these stickers. So that is a priority today. So if you didn't know, if you donate to the Forgotten Dog Rescue, we will mail you free stickers. The info is below. Just screenshot us your donation and uh, DM us on Instagram that screenshot. Even if it's just a dollar. I mean, obviously I hope you do more than a dollar, but even if it's just a dollar, I will mail you a free sticker of your choice. Yep, you're right, Lotus. Christmas lights are all around. I can see them now. All right, so we got a little bit of a drive here. Figured I'd uh, tell you guys a quick little story. So we stopped at my parents briefly yesterday. And if you saw yesterday's vlog, you know that. Although I don't think I filmed anything there. My mom came out and like took a photo of the pups in the car. And it was a good photo. She's like, oh, I got a good one finally. You want me to send it to you? And I'm like, no, mom. Like, it's, I mean, it's fine. Like, I, but I, nothing against your photo. I just, I have thousands of photos. Like, you don't have to send it. Don't worry about sending it to me. I know every photo of you is important. I know, I know. She's like, yeah, you're right. You know, you take photos all the time. It's like, yeah. We go to leave, moments later, my phone goes off. Photo from my mom. So, I don't know. I'm sure everybody's mom is like that, but it's just like, I hear what you're saying. I'm just gonna do it anyways. It was a good photo though. Made it here. I know you so psyched. I know. I know. Boys, check out that old cabin. What you think of that? Probably bigger than our house. All right, boys, we're officially on the trail. I like that we had to drive like way out here. Come on. There's only one other car. One car pulled up as we were getting on the trail. But best I can tell from the map, there's really like no other like way for people to come in and seeing how there's no other car places to park cars really close by i'd say our odds are pretty good that there's only one person on this trail minus if that car that pulled in behind us gets on it oh well, boys i just want to make a little distance just a little bit i think the pups might get a little bit more freedom today unlike yesterday's fiasco of dogs everywhere which if you haven't seen that you can go back and check out that vlog but nothing but socializing practice 
where today I think is gonna be more of our relaxed day. All right, boys, we are now entering the fort. So it's not like a fort like you think of. It's more of a uh, ceremonial fort, probably like a burial ground. I'm gonna let you guys decide which way should we go. We go left or we go right? Seriously? <sighs> he sees something. Come. Oh, good boy. This is a good boy. So if you don't follow the pups on Instagram, you should. We post to the stories when we do stuff like this. Okay, so it looks like if we go straight, this will take us to the lookout point. Okay, well, let's do that, boys. Oh, heel. There's that one other person. I want to see your one socialization practice for the day, it looks like. Are you coming this way? Yeah. Okay, come on. He's just afraid. So, yeah. What's that? Yeah. Aw. The guy stopped and talked to us, and he had two sticks. When you take all that into consideration, it really wasn't too bad. I mean, there was a time where if people just said a word to us, Lotus would start barking at them, so <laughs> I'll take it. Hey, Lotus, did you read the sign? Are you even allowed to go that way? No, come. Not supposed to go that way. I don't think anyways. And boys, it seems like we've made it to the end, to the lookout. And my oh my, does it look like one heck of a view. Wow. Wow, boys. I mean, views on views, I don't even know if that says it. That's just unreal. That's pretty cool. Lotus, don't you want to see the view? Got the views on views? No, you don't. Lotus, come. I don't think he likes how it's, it's a little windy up here. It's a little windy. Oh man, check out all them views, boys. And that's the Ohio River, in case anybody is wondering. Oh, you think it's cooler to check out what's on the ground? All right, pup, we're gonna leave. You wanna take this little side path back or you wanna take the main path? You just take the main path? All right. Easy. Oh, boys, this is uh, kind of steep, and it looks like we have to go back up it. Why, you hear all them trains? Yeah. I know, right? Now, had I known this path ahead of time, it was very obvious that the old guy was not going to go this way. I had a 50-50 chance. I guessed wrong. But in the future, I'll know that any older person walking with a walker or a cane, they're, they're not going to choose this route. In fact, I'm gonna say most people are gonna choose this route, period. You know, I gotta say too, with this being Indian burial grounds, they have signs that say, you know, stay on the trail. So I was like, well, okay, I'm gonna have to, I mean, I always want them to stay on the trail anyways for like fleas and ticks, but you know, Lotus, you do the best you can. Uh, I thought it might be like an issue, like I'd have to constantly be on him, but honestly, I can't, maybe once, one time that I can recall so far that I had the time now, get back on the trail. Wow, boys, this is pretty cool. This is really cool. We're almost to the exit. Looks like we got a couple humans. No, not the enemy. Uh, not gonna be our friends though either, I don't think, buddy, sorry. Heal. All right, heal. Oh, good boys, break, good boys. That's good boys, yeah. Oh, good job, Lotus. Yeah, Enzo, good job, good boys. I remembered to pack water, but we didn't need it this time. Uh, this is about an hour. Compared to some of the recent days, doesn't seem like much, but still a pretty good hike, don't you think? Yeah, I'm sure you'd go all day, I know, I know. But we still got some errands to run. Got to see a special guest. I know, do you know who it is? You do? I don't think you do. I'm so glad I lugged all this water on my back for nothing. And I spilled it on myself. Awesome. Break. Nope, Lotus here. This one's yours. Lotus is like looking out of the corner of his eye. Go on. Up. 
and so in. Any day without the muddies, that's a good day, right boys? That's a good day, huh? Well boys, I gotta say, after uh, having to park next to a fairly busy road yesterday, this is kinda nice. All right boys, we made it. We're at my sister's house. She's got two pup-pups. Yeah, Enzo's played with them. I've got some puppy footage of him playing with them. Obviously, Lotus has not. Oh, there they are. You see them shaved down. Yeah, except for their heads. Yeah. What are you boys doing? Yeah, you tell them. <laughs> My boys, no barks, no nothing. It's all calm. All right, now we gotta do a little Christmas shopping. Hopefully, finish it up. Hopefully, maybe, probably not. That little bridge that we crossed over, we are now in a different state. We are in Indiana. First time on the vlog, we're in Indiana, I believe. Ohio, Kentucky, yep, plenty of times, both of them. Never Indiana, boys. All right, just kidding. We're still in Ohio. Now we're in Indiana. That's why it smelled the same, boys. So now what do you think of Indiana? Okay, well, still smells the same, I guess. All right, so when we're up looking at the views and you can see a bridge and stuff like there's the railroad bridge over there. There's obviously the highway bridge that we're about to cross over, but we were up there. We've driven by this a lot of times. Never knew that was up there. Again, for security reasons, can't show our location, but I think we're gonna have better luck today. All right, boys, success, we got it. I mean, it wasn't the original thing that I tried to get yesterday, but I think she'll like this too. I just gotta get a quick little allergy shot, and then we're heading home. We're done for the day. I can hear you in there. Lotus, you still down there? Hey, Lotus. Oh, you're, oh my gosh, I didn't even see you. Kind of freaked me out for a second there. Let's see that husky. Hey, Enzo, you know it's bad when the husky thinks you're the crazy one, right? You don't, you don't care, you don't care. What did you get? What did you get today? You... Christmas collars showed up. Oh, got them Christmas collars. We order their collars from a little store on Etsy called Wiley Wags because they're amazing. Oh my goodness. Wow. You gonna be so handsome. Be so handsome in this. Mommy has to always tighten yours up. Come here, Papa. Come here, the BB. Come here. I'm see. Oh. Oh my goodness. How handsome is that? Well, let's see it. <laughs> Come here, Enzo. Big boy. Yeah. I'm gonna have to tighten yours a little bit. You like it now, buddy. Big boy. So we gotta make sure that if we're on a leash that we don't pull it off of there, huh? Yeah, leashes are dumb. Oh my goodness! Wow! You so Christmassy? I think his fur's a little messed up on that side. You so Christmassy? <laughs> Such a handsome one, yeah. I know, that is so handsome. The one remaining mail time that's been missing. It looks like they sent us some pictures. Oh, look at that pup pup. Did you see the pup pup? Wow. Oh, see that pup pup? So this says Nisha will, will rally Enzo and Lotus, and I will note every name is spelled correctly yeah. there. I'm a student pharmacist at Cedarville, which is between Dayton and Columbus. I have a year and a half left of school and hopefully a year or two of residency. So it will be a while before I can get a dog of my own. I love hiking and backpacking, so I hope to have a canine adventure buddy one day. Being single and working full time, I'll have to find the right fit. I'll likely rescue. 
I love pharmacy, but school can be rough, so I like watching YouTube videos to relax and learn new things on brain breaks. I found your videos, and I'm so thankful for all that I've learned and seeing such a loving family. Seeing you go to new parks and hike with the pups makes me so excited to do the same with my dog one day. Since I know Nisha likes pictures, I've enclosed two pictures of my family dog, Buddy. We rescued him when I was in the fifth grade, which was 13 years ago, and he is the perfect guy for my family. He was a faithful study partner until I had to leave for college. The second picture is when I was home during COVID. I had briefly petted him before going back to typing notes during a lecture, and he shoved my laptop out of the way so I could pet him again. While I'm not at school, I have my parents send me a daily puppy picture. Thank you so much for sharing your life with the world on YouTube. I wish you all the best. Sincerely, Kate Pruham. She has a pup up too. Well, did that make you be quiet for a minute? <gasps> you guys got the monies? Who sent you this money? That's like real money too. Oh my goodness. You are spoiled. Who sent you this Christmas money? It's probably actually birthday money from a while and, ago. And at the rate that we go, it might be last year's birthday. It could possibly be. <laughs> Dear Will and Nisha, my name is Patrick. I have two dogs. They are a mini schnauzer and a toy poodle. I've been watching a lot of your videos and wanted to ask you some questions. Do German Shepherds get along with smaller dogs like mine? I was thinking of getting a German Shepherd in the next couple of months. I also want to know what the best type of German Shepherd to get. Next couple months, did we even make that deadline? Probably not. Also, if you can tell me some of the important things to know, that would be great. Please email me the answers. For the record, I did do that like a couple weeks ago. You did email? Yeah, a did couple weeks ago. Did you answer his question? Yeah, uh, no, I told him you would answer them in the video. Oops. Yeah, but some of these can't be answered in the video. I don't know. Because remember. some of them are much longer than that. I did not know what to get Enzo and Lotus, so use what is inside to pick out something that they would like. Sincerely, Patrick. Thank you so much, Patrick, for sending them cash monies. I guess we're going to be making a trip to PetSmart oh, to guess. pick out some toys for the boys. You did not have to do that. That was so very thoughtful. Okay, so first question. You have tons of toys. Do German Shepherds get along with smaller dogs like mine? I definitely answered that. Yes, they do, obviously, but they adapt better when they're socialized from a young age. So obviously if you get a German Shepherd puppy, they're not gonna know any different, a cat, a small dog, whatever. Like that um, is, yeah, it's gonna be perfectly fine because they have been exposed to that from a very young age. So yes, they can definitely get along with smaller pups and or smaller other animals. I also want to know what is the best type of German Shepherd to get? So I don't know that there's a best type. So you're really choosing male or female and then you're choosing working line or show line. And then there's other options within there. Obviously we're partial to the working line and partial to male. So if I were getting another pup, I think we've talked about when we get another one, if we ever got another one, it would be a female. But honestly, I think that we would have to get another male. I think that's a bad idea. Boba, you got opinion? Yeah, his opinion is he doesn't want to share any more cuddles, so well, stop. we're not getting another one. I'm just saying that in the past, we've always said if we ever got another dog, we would get a female. But honestly, I'm so partial to having boys that I feel like if it came down to it and we had to pick, I would get another male. So we prefer males and working line. Um, but what I would suggest that you do is research as much as you possibly can um, and find out what is the best fit for you and your family. The last question, this is the one that's a little bit longer. It says, also, if you can tell me some of the important things to know, that would be great. So I always suggest getting on the, we have the playlist oh, yeah, on yeah. the channel. And it is basically every video in order from oldest to newest. And a lot of our older videos are very much like, you know, three simple ways to do this and like crate training, potty training, well, five like, things that you need to know when you get a German Shepherd, like all that kind of very informational structure. I'll link some of those below. Yeah, structured type of videos. That's what I usually recommend people do when they want to know that type of stuff. So I would suggest going through that playlist. Anybody else got anything to say? You guys better tell Patrick thank you because he sent you guys 35 stinking dollars. No, it's share. $35. What are you going to buy with this $35 of cash money? No, it's not pup pup dollars. Oh my goodness. You got to go with us. 
You got the FOMO. You got the FOMO. Oh my goodness. And go for our evening drive, pick up dinners with us. Yeah. Because you haven't had enough car time today. Oh my goodness. Yeah, you want to go potty first? Let us come in with? <laughs> really? Enzo. Babe, he's got to go to the bathroom. He just did. I know, but he might have to poop. I doubt it. He is. Is he really? Yeah. <laughs> my bad. My what bad. Got your flashlight? Yeah. Fling one over the fence. This flashlight is amazing. Yeah, that thing is legit. Nighttime? Daytime. Oh, Nighttime? Daytime. <sighs> Get in the car. Come on. All right, do your rant again. This time I got the camera on. <laughs> Apparently you've been upset by a few people. There was like 50 comments in YouTube, or 53 comments in YouTube, and 50 of them were people thinking that I'm pregnant because of the last video. We went to the grocery store so that I could have popcorn and ranch. Who doesn't like to dip their popcorn in ranch dressing. That is such a um, normal American the thing record, to do. I, I don't. But you're not normal. The normal oh, person well, likes to take their popcorn, whether it's like butter popcorn or like the white cheddar popcorn and dip it in ranch dressing. Like that's totally normal. So no, I'm not pregnant. If we get another pup, we have to have a bigger house. Well, to add a human addition, we would also have to have a bigger house. So definitely not happening. I think the ranch thing is weird and that is not American. So we'll do some color next year. Yeah, we should. Although that blue stands out. But we got llama, we got the farm. Oh, we got another package. Oh, that's a wet nose, yeah. In a completely unexpected, never before seen portion of the vlog, Pups and I are going to the park. That'll be in the next vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and consider subscribing to see more of Enzo and Lotus. Appreciate you guys as always. Hope you guys are having a good one. And Vlogmas continues tomorrow. See you guys.